Hello guys and welcome to another video in the series of Linux tutorials. In this video, we are going to talk about four commands that are cut command, paste command, join command and column remove command. So let's begin. First of all, we have cut command. This command is used when you want to print some section of lines present in a file. Okay. In simple terms, you can say that if you want to print some particular column, then you can use the cut command. For example, here we had inside the documents, we have a file with the name, let's say name data and you will see the data are separated by the space. Okay. Now let's say that I only want to print the names for that I can write here cut. Okay then f f means which column or which field do you want to print so i will give here one okay and then the d d option is for delimiter delimiter means by what character the fields are separated for example if you see here the delimiter is space okay by default when we i am using the cut command it is set to the tab okay to override it i have to specify here dash d option okay so i will use the delimiter as space Okay, and then give the name of the file that is name data, right? Now you will see only the first field is printing. Okay, now let's say that I want to print first field and third field. For that, I can again run the same and then I will do here comma and then three. Okay, it means print first field and third field and the use the separator as space. Okay, so if I press enter, you will see now first field is being printed and the third field is printing now you can also specify the ranges here for example i can define the range here let's say 2 to 3 okay it means that print the field from 2 to 3 so if i press enter you will see that the second field is printing out and the third field is printing out okay so let's take an example of another file which is password file present inside the etc folder okay if you see here the field delimiter is colon okay so let's say i want to print the first field and then from fourth to sixth field okay for that i can write here cut space dash f now i want first field and then four to six field okay then i can specify here delimiter as which is colon here okay in this file the delimiter is the colon okay then i will specify the name of the file that is etc and password okay so if you see only those fields are printing out if you see here this was our first field and in the above also if you see this is our first field then this was our second third and fourth okay so i printed the fourth to sixth okay so this was fourth fifth and till here sixth right and here also you will see that this was our fifth field and then this was sixth and this was our fourth okay if you want to print four to every other field then you can leave here as it is okay it means that from the fourth print till the end of the field okay so if i press enter now you will see seventh field that was the last field is also printing out so this is how you can use the cut command note that we can also provide here multiple file option for example let's say the i want to print the first field okay with the delimiter as space and then the file name to be name data and name last okay so first it will give me output for the first file okay and then it will give me output for the second file okay if you view the content of second file then you will see the first field has name inside of it okay that's what happened here this was printed for the second file and this was printed for the first file okay if you want another example then you can write instead of one you can write here two okay then you will see in the first file in the name data file the second field was our gender so this was printed and in the name last file the second field was our last so these are printing out okay so now let's clear it after that we have paste command okay paste command is used to merge lines between different files okay so basically it is used to merge two different files right so let's say our first file is if you see the content that is name data okay so these are the content of our first file and the content of other file is these okay now let's say i want to merge these two files so i can write the command here paste then the name of our first file let's say name data and then name of the other file okay that was name last okay now you will see the content of the different files have been merged together okay or you can say that the 
lines of the different files have been combined into the single line okay for example this line and this line has been converted into the single line okay and these are separated by the slash tab by default the delimiter used by the paste command is slash t or we can say the tab character if you want to change it then you can use the option here d okay and then give here any character okay for example i can give here colon now if you see here the lines are getting connected by the colon instead of the tab character okay so if you want to change the default delimiter used by the paste command then you can use the option here dash d now let's say that i want to print the field name and the field last okay which are present in the different file so what how can i achieve it okay so first of all what i will do i will paste these two files right with the delimiter with the space okay so i can write here name data and name last okay now you will see the output is in this way after that i need to cut the first field and the fifth field okay this was our first field second third fourth and fifth field so what can i do i can write the same command and then i can write here again cut and then dash f and then the first field and the fifth field and the delimiter to be used is space okay now you will see only the first field and the last field is printing out okay so it is making a perfect name that what is the first name and what is the surname so this is how you can use the paste and cut command in a meaningful way okay so let's clear it now after that we have join command this command is used when you want to combine the line on the basis of some common field okay or in simple terms when you want to merge columns on the basis of some common fields okay for example here if you see this file our column name is in the second field okay similarly if you see in name data file the name is in first field okay now let's say that i want to combine these two files on the basis of the name field okay so in the first file we have name as a second field and in the second file we have name as a first field okay so if i want to join them then i can write here join then j1 okay j1 means that what field you want to use in the first file okay so i want to use the second field so i'll write here 2 and then j2 okay so what field you want to use in your second file so i want to use the first field so i'll write here 1 okay then i will specify my first file that is names okay and then the second file okay name data right so now you will see our common field has only been written once okay other than that if you want to change your default field separator then you can use the dash t option okay and inside it you can specify your delimiter right now after that we have the column remove command column remove or the call rm command is used to remove the fields from the lines okay by default it takes the input from the standard input and it does not take file as an argument okay so let's say that i write here column one okay two three right and then i will press enter you will see it is asking me to write some line okay to write some words so let's say i write here this is nice day okay now you will see the first to third column will be removed now the column start from this location right so thi is going to be removed and rest of the string is printed out okay similar to that let's say i give another string give another and then again the first three characters are removed okay the first three columns are being removed if you want to close it then you can press ctrl c okay now most of the time we does not require to write in this way we require to give it input in the form of file okay for that we can use the standard input redirection and then give the file name okay let's say the file name to be name data right and here i will specify the column numbers so let's say the column number is one two let's say sixth okay now you will see from one to sixth columns has been removed okay so this has removed the first six characters of every line of the file name data okay so this is how you can simply use the column remove command so now let's clear it now all the commands that we studied today that is cut command paste command and then there was join command and call remove command is used when there is a file with a particular format okay for example we were seeing there was a particular format in which first names were written and then there was the last name there was grade there was gender like 
that okay so when there is particular format in the file then these commands are mainly used okay these are mainly also used in the database files in which records are written in the particular format okay but you can always use this command in a meaningful for your personal purpose okay so that's all for today guys i hope you like the video if you have any doubt please comment it down thanks for watching and i have to see you in the next video